Hey, yo, Trey, what do you think about this? It's straight up. I don't know about the polka dots, though. That shit look kind of crazy, man. I don't know, though. I think I can rock this joint. Hey, Jay. How are you? Hey, Jay. How are you? Good. 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 I'm as good as you look right now. Must be pretty perfect, huh? <laughs> I mean, look, you look great. Hey, you, hey, you look at down here. Phenomenal. Hey, hey sensational. sensational. <laughs> okay, future. <laughs> Speaking of the future, when are you coming to the restaurant? Jay, how many other girls have you invited to this restaurant? Look, I invite a lot of girls, but I need a grown woman in the building. <laughs> here he is. Here he is. The choice back to the back. What's up, nigga? What the hell your ass doing in here? You working again? Hell yeah, working. And and I'm gonna tell my sister, your punk ass up here trying to hide like these hoes. Who the hell are you calling a hoe? Ain't nobody talking to you. Look, I was just inviting a young lady to the restaurant, bro. And when the hell you get out of juvie anyway? Last week, nigga, I worked here. I got a job and shit. Pretty good. I'm out here working and shit. And they hired you. What'd you do? Lie on the resume? Enough of that, bro. I'm gonna need you something. You have to do something. Run me a little bread if you want me to keep my mouth shut. I'm saying, from telling your girlfriend, my sister. Your girlfriend. Yeah. Trying to blackmail me and shit. I ain't got no. You got, you got cash out? Yeah, I got cash out. <laughs> you probably ain't got cash yeah, out. Yeah, I got cash out. Car, on your way out. On no your way, way out. out. <laughs> you a wild. Anyway, bro, let me make it. All right. This shit good as hell. <laughs> okay, okay. So you were right about hiring the new chef. Pat yourself on the back once you're off the clock. <laughs> that's why I hired you and made you manager, Jay. Hey, look. Our new menu is on point. We're gonna have problems keeping food in here, I swear. Now that's what I like to hear. <laughs> now, if you do just like we discussed and keep that health inspector issue, Far behind us, I might fool around and make you co-owner. Hey, yo, Mr. Harrington, that'll be like a dream come true. And I <laughs> promise you, I will not let you down. All right. And don't worry about the health inspector. Okay. I got that already handled. All right. <laughs> My man, you like to hear that. <laughs> Shit. Shit, what? Hello, my name is Andrew Hoffmeister, but you can just call me Mr. Hoffmeister. Uh, uh, I'm looking to see if there's a Mr. Harrington here. Hello, Billy. Uh, can we talk for a moment in private, sir?
Maxine, I thought your country ass said you had this health inspection shit under control. Max, you good? I thought we had something special. Jay, you gotta sweet talk me like you do them little girls you've been running with, right? Honey, what's wrong? I can tell something's wrong, I can see it all on your face. Babe, I wanted all night to end different. I didn't want it to end like this. What do you mean? Look, I got you and your restaurant health department issues taken care of. I lied on my report saying that you took care of the code issues. Well, that's not what it seemed like. Did you do what I told you to do or not? I know I made some promises to you and to Alex that I just can't keep. Well, that's not how it seemed, especially the way your boss, Mr. Hoffmeister, came in there with his thick ass glasses on, expecting every other day. Well, what? Did you have the exterminator come by or not? But my back is against the wall. And I need to go back to my wife and kids. They need me now more than ever. I forgot. Okay? I forgot. Your wife needs me? What about me? Look. Look, nothing. I can't fathom that I believed your lying ass for all these years. I wasn't lying. I did leave my wife. Leave your wife? You said you were in the process of getting a divorce from your wife. You forgot? What do you mean you forgot? How the hell did you forget? Now my supervisor's gonna find out a lot on my paperwork. Look, it's Mr. Hoffmeister calling right now. Damn, Jay, you better not get me fired. Good evening, sir. Onyx, Onyx, please don't leave me. Onyx, Onyx, don't, don't leave me! What was he saying? Yes, yes sir. I'll notify the business first thing in the morning. Urban. You know I gotta give you a hard time, but I'm so proud of you with your big new job. Hey. Mm. You know how we do, man. I'm only doing my thing. <sighs> hey, babe. What's up with you? Hey, uh, Ma. Where you at? I'm hanging out, chilling. Where you at? You know what I mean? Just outside getting to that bag. Mm. You must be with your daddy. No, I am not with Sorelli Hans. Where you at? The crib with Amos? No, he's out of town to run. He's working to get your mama a new car. Why, Mr. Detective? Out of town like, like, like another city? Yeah, like not in Los Angeles. Why are you all in my business? Don't make me take you out my wheel, little boy. These parking lot meetings make me feel like a bad girl out here. A oh, bad girl? Now, you used to be a bad girl. Now you done went and got yourself all saved up, so-called. Uh, <laughs> uh, I am saved, and you need Jesus. <laughs> uh, I, well, hallelujah. <laughs> Look, Mom, I'm just checking on you. You know, you be with these old outside for the streets as niggas, so I'm just making sure you're good. I'm good. I'm real good, especially that long date me and Amos just had. Mama, 
Ain't nobody trying to hear all that. It's disgusting. Look, don't be getting me caught up with your little so-called girlfriend, Dorothy. Whoa, 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 now, now, listen. She does not need to know anything about this. Okay, that's your secret. Did you bring money? Where's the money? I got your money. Mm. I got your money. Just take my bag right now. Mm. Mm. Uh, can you just give it to me, please? What's up with you and Lexi? That's what you need to be focused on. Look, me and Lexi are doing just fine. We're great, actually. You must know all the growth of business. Boy, spell my business. As a matter of fact, your business is my business. Yeah. Now listen, don't go running off to Mexico with my shit. Boy, this is not enough money to get someone like me to Calabasas. <laughs> but, um... I'm gonna do this for you, but just know. <laughs> you now owe me. Owe me. I got you. Okay. I got you. Okay. Love you. Love you too. I'm gonna let my mother, let me call you right back. Breaking news in the death of Onyx O'Neill, a man, man whom LAPD says was murdered and his body found in North Hollywood. Do you ever go home to your own house? <laughs> you better stop playing with me, Jay. Now you know I love your house. <laughs> you should have never mm. given me a keyboard. <laughs> Look, well, I love you being here, so. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> this is for you. Okay. What's now, this look. Home? The pharmacist said, make sure you take your meds for food. Look, I know how to take my medicine. Now, how much do I owe you? You don't owe me nothing. So don't be trying to pull your little bill fall out. I got it. It's already oh. taken care of. Oh, just because you got a little promotion, you think <laughs> you can boss G-Mama around like you do the little girls of yours? <laughs> <laughs> you got to chill out. No, no, not my job. I would never do that. <laughs> OK. <laughs> Money. What's got you laughing so hard? You've been laughing since I walked in. TikTok. <laughs> TikTok? Yeah. Sharice taught you how to use TikTok? Yeah. Oh or, my God, you look, are officially corrupted, right? Why don't we go viral? What you mean? Me and you, let's do a TikTok video. G Money, you want to do a TikTok with me? Yeah. We can do it. <laughs> if they can do it, can we do it? Let's do it then. Come on. Yeah, come on. Come on. Let's do this TikTok then. You can use it. All right. <laughs> oh, man. I'm tired as hell. Jay, bring me a cup of water from the fridge. Oh, I ain't danced like this in a minute. But it was fun. Hey, you killed yeah. that, baby. You killed that, G. <laughs> we got to do it again. I'm down. I'm down. Mm. Hey, look, Cherie's gonna be jealous. Mm -mm. I know she is. <laughs> but look, tell me this. How is things going on your job? Honestly, it's going pretty good. I mean, I got this little health inspector issue, but I think I got it covered. At least I hope. <laughs> yeah, well, what about that issue you inherited from your trifling ass daddy? <laughs> You just gonna talk about your own son that way? Hell yeah, I'm gonna talk about his <laughs> ass. I didn't hear it that day. <laughs> well, <laughs> well anyway, let me tell you this. A dog pee on trees, right? Mm. And that's just what dogs do, they pee on the tree. But you ain't no dog. Just like your daddy going out there on the streets, chasing behind those ladies, Jay. Well, G-Money, I would like you to know that me and Lexi are doing very well. Y'all doing very well, huh? Mm, well, I hope you ain't tidin' out there. Wait, hold on, hold wait, on. Wait, G-Money. Tidin'? Tidin'. No. The word I believe that you're trying to say is thotty. Look, this is why I can't have you and Sharice in the same room at the same time. This is, this is why. Tidin', tidin', whatever. <laughs> I don't give a <laughs> shit. All I know is that I'ma pray that that little girl don't get hurt out there in the street messing around with your butt, Jay. And you know those people are crazy out there in the streets. What's wrong with you, boy? G 
G. She's in good hands with Allstate. All right. <laughs> Don't you be breaking that sweet little girl's heart now. I won't. I won't. I care way too much about that. But look, I'm about to get up out of here, so I will talk to you later. Yeah, well. Mm. All right, then. We going viral, girl. Well, yeah. He's for the streets, too. Mm, mm, mm. Lord have mercy. First of all, what I told you about popping up in my house and stop calling me son. Boy, ain't nobody come here to see you. I came here to see Gigi. Speaking of Gigi crazy ass, that's probably why you're here because you were trying to go viral like we did. You jealous. I saw you coming. <laughs> Boy, ain't nobody worried about you or your little whack ass TikTok video. Okay. But you are always going to be my son. At least until you get married and stop thinking of God's gift to every woman you meet. Well, look, I can't help that your boy is blessed, you know? Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, look, you talk to mama? Yeah, we just both. Well, look, between you and I, I seen Amos ass today. I think his sneaky ass is up to something. What? Jay, come on now, y'all still beefing? Let it go. It's been two years. Ma's happy now. Yeah, whatever. Well, look, I'm about to bounce. I got money to make. You don't know nothing about that. Holla at you. And stop teaching G-Money words like thought. Thought. Yeah, whatever thought. Let him get some rest. Okay. Ooh-wee. It's a hot one today, buddy. Hey, 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 hey. I thought you said you'd fix all the issues listed on the health report. And I here did. I'm, hey, boy, don't cut me off. Like I was saying, you said. This is you talking now. You said that you had fixed all the stuff that was listed on that report. I did. I called the cleaning people. It looks spotless. I called the maintenance people about the leaky AC. That's fixed. And I called the exterminator. No, no. I, I, don't lie to me, boy. I already know that the exterminator never came out. Look, I don't understand what the health department's issue is. It's not like we got bugs and rats and roaches running around. We got protocols and procedures that we have to adhere to in order to keep it that way. I got this old ass white man coming up here telling me I got 10 days in order to fix this stuff, otherwise he's closing this down. 10 days? What, what the hell am I supposed to do with 10 days? All I know is you better figure out and find out what to be doing in 10 days. 10 days. Look, I got a handle, Mr. Harrington. I'm on top of it. Oh, you're on top of like you're on top of that uh, health inspector? Uh, what's her name? Uh, uh, Maxine? Yeah. <laughs> uh, I didn't even know about that. Son, look, I might be getting older, but I'm not dumber. And your, your little young ass, you think you can fuck your way past the government? No, huh? I don't think nothing like that. No, nah, my ass. Look, you got 10 days. You either figure out how to fix this, or you pack your bags and you get the hell out of my restaurant, OK? Hey, man, chill. I got it. I got it, Mr. Harrington. I'm on top of it, like I said. It's handled. All right. You handle event. No, that's not it. You handle Justin. I'll handle revenge. Ah, oh, that's come on, come on, you got this. You handle Justin. I'll handle revenge. Oh, you starting to feel it now. Girl. Come on, you got this. You handle Justin. I'll handle revenge. Put your oh, goddamn hands boy. up, sucker. <laughs> scared the hell out of me, son. <laughs> you, oh, what you doing here? You scared me. Came to check in on my mama. How you feeling? I'm good. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. You in here killing it. I'm trying, I'm trying. You messed up a good audition, baby. Well, what you audition Shoot. for now? A Foxy Brown reboot, but you wouldn't know nothing about that young buck now, would you? <laughs> First of all, I ain't that young. Boy, I know how young you are. <laughs> Talking to. Oh, man, well, I hope you book it, because we need to get out the hood. Yeah, we need to move to the east side. Oh. We need to move to the east side. Not the east side of L.A. No, definitely not the east side of L.A. <laughs> Dang, you messed up a good audition. Shoot. So, uh... Well, Amos said I ain't see his truck outside. He's outside working. Working out somewhere. OK, well, take a break. Come holler at me real quick. Boy, I popped you out this hot box a long time ago. I know when something's on your mind. What's up? Well, look, I don't want to be accusing nobody of anything. Mm-hmm. But you know the other day when we was on the phone? The other day what, nigga? What? 
I kind of followed Amos the other day. And? And, look, mama, I seen that nigga link up with some chick in his truck. And it just. And what happened? It looked a little too cozy for me. They kissed, they hugged. I don't know. You, and? Look, mama, he ain't shit. Hello, are you Ms. Raven Johnson? Yes, Detective. I'm Detective Adams. This is my partner, Detective Freeman. Raven Johnson. I would say it's a good day, but it's not. Oh, Detective Freeman. So nice to see you again. Ms. Johnson, what is your relationship with an Onyx O'Neill? Onyx? He was just someone I was fucking. So you admit that you know him? Know him? No. I knew him. Knew him? So you know that he was murdered? Yes, detective. I was expecting officers to show up at my house after I was watching the news and saw that my ex-boyfriend, if you want to call him that, was murdered. I just wasn't expecting my good friend to show up. I'm sorry, were you planning on calling the police to let us know your connection to this man? Raven, do you mind if we come inside so we can speak with you? Of course, Detective Freeman. You can come inside anytime. Plus, you guys are blocking my son. Let's go. Um, excuse me, future wife. Mm-hmm. Where do you think you're going? I'm ready for round two. Bring that ass back. <laughs> well, I'm ready for a shower. Mm. You should be too. Dang, them armpits singing a little tune. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Speaking of tunes, let's talk about them notes that you was hitting last night. Ah. Wow. <laughs> wow. Anyways, what's on your schedule tonight? Well, I have to actually go into the clinic. Mm. We all don't have the luxury of creating our own schedule. <laughs> you think you the shit now, huh? I mean, look, don't hate on your boy because I'm out here getting promotions. Hey. Or is it because I'm running the hottest black-owned restaurant this side of Hollywood? So you bragging now? <laughs> Just a little bit. You know what? I'm really proud of you, babe. You deserve it. All those long nights you spend in the restaurant. But that cheap ass owner, he needs to be breaking you off and making you partner if you ask me. Hey, you ain't lying though, for real. I'm the shit because of what I do for that place. You saw it last night, it was packed. Yeah, you the man, I know that for sure. And that's what the ladies think too, huh? Here you go. Look, I don't know how many times I gotta tell you, but I'm not worried about none of these girls running in and out the restaurant, asking for me, name dropping. I'm only here for you, and only you. Don't start that lying shit, Jay. Okay? I know you're messing around on me. This is the same thing you do. You get a job, Lexi, you bring in Lexi, girls. Lexi, you get a chill. job, you bring in girls. Yo, my job is literally to promote the restaurant. So you know what that comes with. What? Talking to the house. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I'm just trying to make this an honest living. Okay. But stop playing with me. Look, Lex, you know, you know you're my soulmate, right?
I know I can't keep up with all of your hoes, but I do know one thing. At least use a condom if you gonna cheat, Jay. These are what? Nicotine patches. Oh. For who? Where so, are the condoms at, Jay? Huh? Where are they at? So what, are you telling me that I should cheat? Are you, are you, you're giving me like a hall pass? What is this? I've never seen nobody give somebody permission to cheat. No, I'm just keeping it real. But let me tell you this. The very first time you bring something home to me, give me some shit, it's a motherfucking funeral. First of all, your ass ain't gonna do shit. And you know I would never do that. Yeah, okay. But I love when you act tough. Look, come here. What's up, sis? What you up to, son? I know you probably just now crawling out from between some little freaks. <laughs> you crazy. Hey, yo. Hey, chill. You know I got a girl. Hey, what's up? What do you want? But anyways, I was calling to tell you mama is pissed off at Amos. <sighs> Look, I ain't got nothing to do with that. Look, I, I gotta go. What you? Damn. Lex, Lex, come on. Lexi. Lexi, stop it. You know my little sister. All she does is play all the fucking time. You gonna take that shit seriously? Come on, dog. Look, you gonna do what you gonna do as long as I keep forgiving you and giving you chance after chance. Look, I know I don't have some luxury apartment or some high dollar car or even some fancy car, Jay. But I know I've done everything to prove to you that I'm down for you. And nothing I seem to do is enough for your trifle guys. Lex, you are good enough. How many times do I gotta tell you that shit? Look, sweetheart, I just need you to be patient with me. I just got the promotion. I'm just trying to build this shit out. So we can get married. It's gonna happen soon enough, I promise. And fuck everything else. I didn't heard it all before, James. Really? Lex. Lex, come on. Oh, well, first of all, I ain't that old. And second of all, gas is expensive. So I know you looking like that, you gotta have some. You better stop touching on me like that, girl. Oh. My daddy always mm -hmm. said age ain't nothing but a number, Miss Wither. Oh, you yes, play. and uh, you do look to be a little too young for me. So where is your sexy ass daddy at? Uh, did he settle down yet? Nah, you know he ain't settling down, man. So really, he, you know, he play it for life. You know? mm, well, send him over here and I'll make him settle down. Cause oh, yeah? you know, I got that good, good on Friday and I'll ring on Sunday and good, good on Friday. Ring on Sunday and. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Ray Ray, come get your friend. All right, look. I'm going to in and look. God. It was good seeing you, Jay, baby. Miss, miss, uh, hey. Watch your step, baby. I got power for hey. my Ray Ray. Big Ray, where you at? What up, nigga? Hey. Hey, but hold on. I'm going to get with you in a minute, all right? All right, for sure. Well, your mama out here asking me for some gas. And you know, I don't even smoke. But shit. <laughs> but nigga, I do. But look, I got one of my baby mamas in here right now, all right? I'm trying to get her to get her shit and leave because my other baby mama on the way, nigga. Right now. I thought all your baby mamas cut along. 
I mean, shit, they do. I mean, the first two, my first baby mama and my second baby mama, them hoes like this, nigga. But ever since I had the kid by the third baby mama, man, them hoes been hell, nigga. <laughs> Look, between your mama out here, your baby mamas, I just can't keep up. It's too much mama shit. Look, I'm in the car. Hurry up, because I got shit to do. I'll be outside. Hurry up. Nigga, I'll right, bet. I'm going to meet you in the car, though. For sure. Ray Ray, hello? Ray Ray, hello? Man, I thought you paid your child support. I know you see me, hello? Hello, Ray Ray. Hey, hey, girl, I'm late for work, all right? Work? Nigga, you ain't got no work. Look, I'll meet you at my mom's house later, though, Your bitch ass better be there, too. Yo. Hey, see, that's why you gotta handle your business so you wouldn't have these problems. Nigga, look, I take care of my kids, all right? What the fuck you mean? Well, I mean, shit, as much as I can, and you know, when I can. Look, man, don't worry about me, though, all right? <laughs> What's up with you and old girl from the club last week? I take her to the crib, you know how I go. We had some weed for her, you know what I'm saying? And so, if we having a good time, bust it down, big freak. Big freak, everything you want, bro. She wildin', right? And so after, you know, nigga, she started talking that shit. I'm thinking we should have a baby boy. A baby boy with hazel eyes, and of course he's gonna need a little sister too. Don't do it, I right? Do not do it, take it from me. And then I think we should move to Beverly Hills because they have the best schools. And that Lexus is cool and all, but I think we need a Lamborghini truck or something a little bit more luxurious. Listen, you for these streets, all right? I don't give a fuck about no hazel eyes, blue eyes, green, gray, whatever the fuck. And I also need my nails done twice a week. I know you haven't dealt with someone as luxurious and glamorous, as classy as I am, but trust me, baby, I am doing all of this for you. What your ass need to do is hit it, quit it, and scoot your ass back to that house with Lexi because you know she your man and you know she gonna hold it down, man. Yeah, real here you go with that Lexi shit, man. Look, we outside with it, my boy. Ain't no man. <laughs> Dorothy, my lady. Um, you good? What's, what's wrong? What's happening? I don't know. Am I good? Hmm? Yeah, hold on, woman. You, you scared me now. What's, what's the matter? What you got to be scared of? Hmm? Look, look here, woman. I don't have no time for no mind games. I just got back home from out of town. Hmm. Oh, yeah, out of town, right? Yeah. Hmm. You selling dope again? What oh, dope? Oh, oh, maybe, maybe, you know, maybe it's that woman that was in your truck. Wait, what? That you, bitch woman? That was in your truck the other day. That's truck? Hold, hold on now, now, now. Who's, who's been saying stuff about me, huh? Who's lying on me? You better watch your tone in my house, Amos. You know what? You're right. I'm sorry. I apologize, okay? But, look, who's been saying stuff about me? What are they saying? So, you gonna tell me you was out of town? Working? Hmm? Yeah. That's what you want me to believe? You gonna tell me to my face that you was out of town working and you had that bitch in your car the other day? Duh, look, duh, look, I can explain all that, okay? Ain't shit to unexplain. You need to get your shit and get out of my house. What? Why? I can explain I everything told to you. you. I done told you now. You need to get your shit. Just... Told your ass to get your ass out of here. I'm not answering the phone. Hey, hey uh, you Jay Carter? Yes. But you cannot run up on... Anyways, pest control, right? Where's all your equipment? Y'all usually show up looking like Ghostbusters. No, I'm not the exterminator, man. I'm the manager of the company. Okay, cool. So, what does that mean? Uh, what that means is that I'm here to inform you that the exterminator that was supposed to be here this morning, right? Yeah, he got in a bad car accident right off the 110, dude. He's not gonna make it. Okay, cool. So you're coming to tell me that somebody's coming later. 
Oh, no, 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 no. So we only have two trucks? When is someone going to come and do the extermination today? Right. The only reason I'm even here is because the business is right down the street. <sighs> Look, I really need this done today, like right now. Yeah, man, he's not looking good, dude. Man, that's my that's my son-in-law. You know that? All right, so can I pay you a little bit more? I'm sure you know how to do it. No. Oh, hope everything works out, bud. All right? Yeah, you show sure fucking this one up, huh? <laughs> Look, man, Mr. Harrington, I'm so sorry. Look, boy, I put all my trust in your young ass to handle this. Now, I prayed about it. And the Lord himself told me to trust you. So that's what I'm going to do for the time being. Man, this food truck taking forever today. You ain't yeah. never lying. Yeah. But this shit going to be good as hell, though. Oh, girl, shorty from the park. Oh, oh yeah, that is her, the one that turned your ass down. Man, she ain't turn me down, turn me down. Nah, nigga, she, she turned your ass down. She played you like a fiddle. Damn, but she bad as hell, bro. I might have to go slide that ass. So, what, what the fuck you gonna do? I don't know, it's redemption time. Yeah, redemption time, but what you gonna say to her? Nigga, I don't know. Shit, but you know the motto. K.I.P. Keep, Keep it playing. Hey, nigga, hold on, nigga. Take that shit out your mouth. You know she boozy. Right, right. Yeah. Good looking. That's why you my nigga. I'm on it. Excuse me, excuse me. Quick question. Um, if you're here, then who's running heaven? You're talking to me? I am. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose God is. Mm -hmm. Because all the angels are busy. Too busy to entertain serpents. <laughs> so you're calling me a snake now. OK, well, look, I just wanted to come over and give you a compliment because you look really, really amazing today. So um, so let me ask you this then. Who hurt you? Because I swear I didn't do it. And I will make up for all of you. OK, <laughs> I know just as well as all the other ladies, which pickup line you're using on me. Mm. Number one, number two, number three, number four, number 24, I don't care. I saw you before you even approached me. And for the record, I'm not hurt. No one hurt me. Well, look, I'm just advertising with the homie for the restaurant. Hmm. Oh, yeah, that little restaurant you told me about last time we ran into each other. You gave me that little QR code. The restaurant I still haven't seen you at. I'm not interested in anything in Hollywood. Mm. Too many tourists. I, I, I get it. I understand that. A lady like yourself. How about a five-star restaurant? A Michelin. Oh. Do you want to take me to dinner at a five-star restaurant? I do. A Michelin one? I do. Spell Michelin. Well, you're talking to a spelling bee champ. M-E-N-U. I'll pass. <laughs> Well, how about you put your number in my phone and we can just get to know each other first. So we just got out of a pandemic and you want me to touch your dirty ass cell phone. Okay, a little, you know what? Just a little I'm, grease. I'm good. And to be honest, I just don't have time for Y-O-U. Have a nice day. <laughs> Damn. It's all right. I'm wearing you down. Hey, yo, Ray Ray. You win some, you lose some. Detective Freeman, such a pleasure seeing you again. Look, Ray, the other day when me and Detective Adams came by, I didn't want to talk in front of her. But just know that I know that when it comes to this Onyx murder, I know your name's written all over it. Now, Detective, are you sure you want to be wrong again? 
Are you sure your career can handle another mistake? Just know I'm watching you. What's up, Jay? You good? <laughs> My bad, like, you just look really good. I mean, you look amazing. I know how it puts you through a lot of bullshit. I mean, a lot, a lot of bullshit. So, I just really want you to know that I appreciate you sticking by me all these years. You know, and I, I do see a future for us, and, and I mean everything that I say to you. I hope you know that. So, I have something I want to give you, um, and I really hope that you like it. <laughs> Whew, shoot. But you like it for real? I do. It's, it's beautiful. Cool, 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 cool. Can I put it on you? Sure. Got my palm sweating, girl. Sheesh. I knew it was coming. Look, okay. To be honest, Mr. Harrington has been on my ass lately. And so I promise you, I promise you that I'm gonna make it up to you. Plus, you look so good in my necklace. <laughs> for you. Who has the necklace on right now? <laughs> you, right? Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> All right, well, I know it's about to get busy in here, so I'm ahead. I'll go see my girlfriends. Okay, well, look, be safe. I know your friends, they're wild. No, they're not. They you can't talk about wild. <laughs> okay, be safe. Thank you for my necklace. Love you. Mm -hmm. I hit you later. Finally came. And I see you have a girlfriend. <laughs> nah, no, 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 that's not my girlfriend. Just an old friend just catching up. You ain't gotta lie to me. Look, if you think I have time for these little girls, you're mistaken. Honestly, because I see something in you, a grown woman, I don't have time for these young birds. So how you feeling? You look good. Well, thank you. Mm. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling myself a little bit. I see. You got your freaking dress on and this left <laughs> it. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> I mean, you look like you're in a good place. I am. I'm in a really good place. You just caught me at a bad time. I just experienced a devastating loss. 
I'm sorry to hear that. It's okay. Never mind. But now I'm good. Cool, cool, cool. Well, look. How about we finally exchange numbers so we can really talk and hang out outside of here? Sure. I guess. You guess? I guess that is, you know, if your girlfriend doesn't mind. Huh. No girlfriend. No woman. No boo. None of that. You can have my number. Phone. You're not giving me no fake number, are you? <laughs> I'm not letting these little girls in the streets. Hmm. Have a good night, Jay. You have a good night, Ray. <laughs> are you fucking serious, Jay? I thought you said you didn't know her. Can I get one day? Just one day, possibly my birthday, where you're not fucking around on me? Lexi, you gonna do that right now? Here? Where I work? Don't start that shit. You acting crazy right now. I came to get my phone. I left it at our table. Not that you would know, because you're not checking to make sure I got home or anything. Because you're too busy exchanging numbers, Jay. How many times do I got to tell you it's not like that? You know what my job consists of. This is just me networking. Never. You always gotta do this old insecure ass shit. Networking Wildin'. my ass. Networking my ass. Okay, I returned to the table and look what I found. A liar. You know what, Lexi? You want me to be a villain so fucking bad? Oh God, get over yourself. Like, I wouldn't be surprised if you did that shit on purpose. You're sick. Fuck you. I'm done. Fuck me? Yeah, fuck you. Happy birthday. What's up? <laughs> Honestly, I didn't even expect you to answer the phone. <laughs> How you feeling? That's what's up, that's what's up. I'm good, honestly. Uh, just enjoying the day so far. What you got up? Hey, yo, man. <laughs> This view is crazy. Right? And this pool is sexy as so. mm. Look, and this jacuzzi, I got a couple ideas for that, you know what I'm saying? Oh my gosh, you're so bad. <laughs> but we have to wait and do that later. Because, Jay, <laughs> I would love to introduce you to my son, Alex. What's up, Alex, man? Nice to meet you, sir. Would you like to throw the football with me for a second? Sure, you ain't gotta call me, sir. But I got a strong one. Let me see if you can catch. <laughs> All right, go long. <laughs> uh, Alex and I were gonna go out for the day. Did you want me to pick anything up for you while we were out? Bit... No, thank you. You both be safe and have fun. <laughs> now, Alex, let Mr. J go. Hey, come on, Alex. Oh, Mom, don't never let us have no fun. All right, Alex, and I'll see you next time. Bye, Mom. Love you. So, be fun. Be good. Have fun. Be, be safe. What do you think? It's a cool kid, man. I think we should get this jacuzzi. <laughs> He's so bad. <laughs> <laughs> 
bad. <laughs> Yo, this is literally the perfect night. I know, what a perfect way to end a perfect date. You know I'm feeling you, right? Look, you're beautiful, you're intelligent. You just got your shit together and you're not looking for no one's hand out. And that's very rare these days. I'm having a really good time with you too. I've been enjoying every second of time we've been spending together. Mm. I haven't felt this way in a while. If you ask me, I can see us being a power couple together. <laughs> With your business expertise and my street smarts, we can take over for sure. <laughs> oh yeah? I definitely see a future with us. Yeah. Do you see a future with me and Alex? Because we can't be hurt again. Both of us have been through enough. And Alex is a really good kid. Like, he's really dope. And believe me, I'm not here to hurt you or him. But you have to be sure that I'm your first choice, Jay. Because I'm not for all those games and stuff like that. I mean, my son's father was murdered. My last relationship fizzled. Guys are just too scared to settle down. Well, I'm not those guys. And I'm definitely not scared of you. <laughs> I didn't say you have to be scared of me. I'm just saying, make sure I'm really what you want, Jay. I kind of think Raven Carter sounds good on you. Ooh. <laughs> Raven Carter, I love the sound of that. So is true love what you're looking for? Or are you just looking to run around for the rest of your life? I can run around a little bit more. Oh my gosh. <laughs> no, 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 I'm just playing. Look, it just depends. Is this true love that I found? Mm, so are you saying that you love me? Because I don't believe you. No, I'm not saying that. What I'm saying is, I'm loving the shit out of you. <laughs> well, I love the sound of that. Stop touching me like that, but we end up in the back of this swan, <laughs> making little swan babies. <laughs> You're so silly. <laughs> oh, man. I don't know why 
all these influencers expect me to comp their bottles. First of all, you ain't that bad. <laughs> Hey, yo, bro, let me, let me call you right back. Handle with care. Fragile. Oh, so it's not enough. I mean, I'm I'm happy with it. Are you? I mean, it's it's giving. Ass is definitely giving these days. <laughs> That's what happens when you when you dump me and you want to come back with a whole bunch of extra ass. What you yeah, to make you jealous. <laughs> You've been in the gym. Okay. I love it. Been oh. eating good. You happy? You look good. You know, a little bit? I guess so. Mm -hmm. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Thick. Ah! <laughs> I talked to you in a little bit. Okay. Answer the phone. Jay? I think one of your crazy bitches just spray painted my car. I told your ass leave those mental health hoes alone at the clinic. Fuck! Raven, I've been trying to get in contact with your ass all day. I can't even believe that you would pull a stunt like that. What stunt, Jay? Oh, well, what stunt, Jay? So you're gonna sit up there and act like you need to spray paint somebody's car? I don't know what you're talking about. It must have been someone else. All right, look. This whole me and you thing, I've been hitting you because okay, I Jay, think that you. I'm sorry. I'll let you finish. I just had to show you this. <laughs> What 
to the pregnancy test, silly. I don't know why you're giving it to me. What's this for? Because I'm pregnant. Hold on. You told me that you can't even get pregnant after cervical cancer. I know. That's what the doctor told me. But I guess he was wrong. Look what God has blessed us Yo, with. Yo, look. <laughs> Raven, you are a sweet woman and all, but this, this is just too much. Way too fast. I can't. Now, Jay. I know you have your other females like Lexi. Hey yo, do not say Lexi's name ever in your life. But I've been doing some thinking and I think you should move in with me. What the fuck? Move in with me and Alex. Yo, you have our... lost your have you lost your damn mind? I'm not moving in with you and your son. Look, the only thing you need to be figuring out is your ass going to the clinic. What about all that? You're what matters to me. I love you, Raven Carter. <laughs> what happened to all that game, playa? Look, I was just caught up in the moment. But this, this is not what I signed up for. Oh, so that's what you're going with? You were caught up in the moment? I knew you were like all the other men I've been with. You come along. You tell me that you love me? You play with my son like you're a good man? You have fun with me just to get me dirty and then you throw me away. What the fuck is wrong with you? Fucking crazy. I love you, Jay. You passed. <laughs> the flying colors, I might add. What'd I tell you? <laughs> you know, I don't want to see either of you ever again. Because in actuality, you have a strike against your health record. And if I have to come down here one more time, I'm gonna shut you down. Have a nice day. Have a nice day. What'd I tell you, though? <laughs> Damn, boy. I didn't think you would get everything done in time. Look, Mr. Harrington, I'm not about to risk this restaurant, my career, or our future on nothing. I, I got it handled, man. You have been a bit MIA here lately. You still chasing all them females? <laughs> Honestly, I think I'm ready to retire, man. Hang up the old jersey. Yeah, I believe that when I see it. Nah, for real, Mr. Harrington, look. I think it's time for me and Lexi to make that next step. Marriage? Are you sure you ready for that, son? Man, hell no. You know I ain't talking about no marriage. I'm talking about moving on in with me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, now that sound more like you. <laughs> Well, let's give you a drink, man. Let's celebrate. We, All right. We still All in right. business. All right. Let's Good do it. Time, man. <laughs> <laughs> Lex, this is Jay. Look, I 
I've been trying to get in touch with you all day. Please call me back. I just want to make sure you're good. Hey, yo, Dre. This is Jay. Man, have you talked to Lexi today or have you seen him? I've been calling her all day, and she hasn't been responding, hasn't answered the phone, so I just felt like you might have seen her. Never mind, this hurts. She just texted me right now. All right. You know, Lex, this is real cute. Having me meet you where we first kissed. I bet you think I forgot. 